Hello friends, welcome to Zayantek. In this video, let's discuss about how to navigate between activities in Android Studio. We can use Kotlin and Java. And let's compare both Kotlin and Java in this video. Just create a new project and choose empty activity, click next and type your application name here. I'm just giving navigation Kotlin. Here you can minimum SDK you can choose and language should be Kotlin. Click finish. Okay, once project a new project is ready, now you can go to layout and here you can choose split both the design, both view you can see and remove this one and uh, change it to relative layout. Instead of the test view, type a button. And here in hello world, you can change it to whatever you want. I'm just giving second activity because when we click this button, we want to redirect to another activity. So I'm just giving second activity and I create an ID name. I give you the ID name. This button BTN second activity. Okay now just alt enter then add the text to string now here you can make it to sender gravity sender now button came in the sender now we need one more activity then you can create second activity here uh, also change it to relative layout Now add one text to view. Put some text. I just give welcome to second activity, okay? And alt enter and add the text to string. And give a ID name. It's not mandatory in this scenario, but anyway, just give. I did text view okay and you can make it center put gravity center or on the here put gravity center no test came on the center if you want you can increase the test size size you can choose to 32 dp now it's recommending change it to sp so we can change the dp to sp okay now go to main activity or we can create a second activity for Kotlin class okay now we created a second Kotlin class and let's copy the same from the main activity because it is created by default paste here and change the layout mapping to our second activity here you can code for the second activity let's go back to main activity and now what we need we need to initialize the button so we are uh, while btn second find view by id button second activity alt enter and import the button class Now we need to button second dot set click listener set on click listener okay here we need to create a new indent while indent is equal to indent here we can insert the parenthesis this and second activity colon colon class dot java so this is the main difference between the java and and start indent activity this is the main difference between java and Kotlin. this programming okay now let's run the project before we running let's go to activity manifest and here 
create one more activity after main activity just create activity and map the second activity till the android we have another one more activity now let's run the project let's see how it is coming okay emulator is loading okay now it's come view second activity click on the button second activity see this navigator to second activity welcome to second activity okay now let's do the same in java how we done the same process same thing navigation between activities in java okay this is what now we are trying to do so let's create one more project and empty project name it uh, navigate java okay you can name anything and I change the language from kotlin to java okay rest all same click finish let's do the same step create a new java file i'll call second activity dot java and from the main main activity let's copy the same thing okay now we need to map the layout to second activity because we not created anyway i'm giving a name here second activity and copy this now we don't want to create the process again so let's copy and paste from the kotlin project because the layout activities are same we are just adding the string to this project only create a second layout called second activity and the same again we can uh, copy from uh, kotlin project because it's the same file only so you can save our time so this xml file uh, there is no difference in java whatever we are if it is in kotlin java there is no difference okay now let's go to manifest and let's tell uh, we have one more activity activity is called second activity okay now let's go to the main activity and define a button button btn is equal to find view id this is the programming for to navigate between activities but little bit of difference between java and kotlin here we are using the semicolon to terminate the sentence btn dot set on click listener new view dot on click listener here we are telling to the new activity indent basically indent 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 is equal to new indent this sorry main activity dot this comma or second activity dot class or not java class now uh, just uh, start activity and basically this is the only main difference now let's run the project emulator is loading now okay now you can see the second activity button it is in the java project just click there welcome to second activity now if you click the back button it will go to the main activity so if you want to disable it this feature just after the start activity just click finish
then it will not go to back okay i hope this video is informative thank you for watching let's see you on the next video thank you